Klezmer music is important because you continue a tradition of the Ashkenazi culture, specifically on Brandeis campus, to reinvigorate that tradition and that culture and educate for people who don't know what it is. What I want people to get out of our music is I want them to dance. It's definitely important for the Jewish community to play this music because this is what our ancestors have been playing. It's just very important that we continue this tradition or else we're going to forget it and lose it. This is our heritage. This is our traditions. I think the Klezmer Band is important because it represents a history that is kind of lost in a lot of other ways by the ongoing Jewish assimilation to American culture. And that's kind of the story of America is that you in some ways leave behind your old history and your language in a lot of cases. But Klezmer is a living history of Jewish culture through music, so that's very special. Klezmer music, it comes from Eastern Europe and specifically like the Jewish areas. And, but it's a lot of um, clarinet and fiddle and some other traditional instruments that it just, it's a very like upbeat sound. It has a lot of branches, just like Jewish culture does. But the main branch that you'll see is Eastern European folk music. Often it has spoken words that are usually in Yiddish which is a combination of German and Hebrew. Yiddish is, in most of the world, a, a dying language. It's, it's a very old world, and it's very improvising heavy. There's something special about klezmer music. When you play it, you have this sense of camaraderie because klezmer music is so improv heavy that you want to be perfectly fit in the mix, and you want to make space for everybody else as well. So you have to keep in mind that like, let's say you, I'm playing a guitar fill, that I make space for the clarinets who also want to do a fill of some sort. And by doing all of that, you bring the band much closer together and you come to this understanding. What being part of the Brandeis Klezmer band means to me is just the fact that I'm able to combine my interest in playing music and specifically in the clarinet and then also being involved in Jewish life on campus. It's just uh, bringing my two, like those two parts of me together. For some people in the band, it's part of their culture. For some people, they're exploring a different side of Jewish culture. But then for the greater community, it's just nice to be able to immerse yourself more. It's not just like you're going to events that are in doing Jewish things, but you're also like, you're experiencing it around you. I think above all, I want people to recognize the happiness in everyday life because so many of the song names are really just let's be happy. It's in Yiddish, so people don't get it anymore. It's a message that transcends the language. 